I am glad to present you the drawing portrait of a Pharisee by Herman Prell. In the Shadow of Betrayal This painting is the sketch for the head of the Pharisee offering the coins to Judas in one of Herman Prell's major works, the painting Betrayal of Judas, completed in 1886. The monumental head, which fills the picture and is distinguished by its ornamented robe, is almost a lost profile, which in the executed painting is justified by the Pharisees turning towards Judas. Despite the fact that the sitter withdraws from the viewer by turning away, it was necessary to artistically elaborate the motivation for the purchase of one of Christ's disciples, which is why the drawing focuses on the expression of the face, while the accessories are treated in a more summary manner. In characterizing the face, Herman Prell performs a balancing act, since the Pharisee, despite his destructive actions, is an actor in the history of salvation. The head must show a dignity appropriate to the event, but at the same time the physiognomy must also bear witness to the scheming attitude that led to the betrayal. To solve this dilemma, Prell draws on the traditional depictions of the heads of the apostles, shading the face to indicate the obdurate darkness of the spirit and moving the base of the nose slightly upwards while the mouth falls away, thus giving a physiognomic expression to the motivation of the action. The fatal drama of the betrayal is expressed in the monumentalization of the head and in the thunderous white highlights that contrast with the darkness of the chalk. As a study, considered by the artist to be a work in itself, this drawing reveals the pictorial problems and brainstorming of monumental painting. I hope I have been able to show you the qualities of the artwork.